Ramaphosa warns people saying the government of national of national confusion uh, or uh, look it's not cannot be about positions uh, Ramaphosa warning people but I like the honestness coming from Ukaitin McKenzie uh, speaking very clear on that matter to say actually the reason right now the re- the real reason why the cabinet hasn't been announced it is, it is simply because it's about power. It's about positions. I like that honestness, especially coming from him. I like that honestness. What are you telling? What are you saying? I'm interested to know. And and secondly, for the fact that Ramaphosa is warning about that, clearly it tells us that there is a struggle. Like there is um, there is this thing of power. Ne? Uh, it's called what? Uh, people are fighting, well, look, people are fighting, you know, people want power, that they want control, they want everything. It, 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 for the fact that we are even talking about it, it's simply put, there is a power struggle and that's the reason. In fact, before I can even read what Ramaphosa says, you will remember that in in Gauteng, the, 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 the provincial uh, cabinet would have been announced Guess why they haven't been announced? Simply because of power. So there's one common thing that we can, cannot run away from, and that is power. Whether we want to say the struggle doesn't look is not there or not, Gaten McKenzie has already said it, and I believe what McKenzie said when he said, "The reason we have all of this it is simply because of power." There is a struggle of power that is currently ongoing that disturbs the process of uh, negotiations disturbs the process uh, in which it will lead to uh, the announcement of a e- local government of national unit ca- local cabinet and everything a cabinet so not cabinet cabinet of and, and and everything right so everything is stuck right there but i can also promise you that we are not stuck in this youtube channel why i'm saying that is because of this if you are not yet subscribed what are you waiting for come on good people because to subscribe it is free to like the video it is free to comment in the comment section below it is free of charge to click the notification bell it is free of charge to share this video it is free of charge to watch this video until the end it is free of charge also good people i mean come on to watch the ads it's free of charge and that's how you financially contribute to this YouTube channel. Speaking about financially contributing to the channel, you can join, become a member of this YouTube channel from as little as 20 rand a month. You can also uh, use the super thanks party. In case you don't want to do that, guys, there is a way where you can use my media company banking details to donate to the channel. And you know what I'm saying? will bring you more and also guys want to buy more equipment so the power is in your hands please do the honorable thing as we proceed okay 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 quite interesting as well um let's go through this one president ramaphosa on monday urged political parties in the government of national uh, national confusion not to be preoccupied with uh, jog- joking for position of power right uh let me just get this one straight guys just give me a few minutes just few minutes few minutes few minutes uh okay 10 parties including the anc da patriotic alliance inkata freedom freedom party good party pan african congress of azania uh, Freedom Front Plus, United Democratic Movement, Arise Mzansi, Al Jama have signed the statement of intent to join the government of national confusion. In his weekly letter, Ramaphosa said, the country's hope are pinned on the success of the, ne- the government of national corruption. The fact. Now, Hey, here, here's something interesting about everything. Tell me, the newsletter, how many people read the newsletter that the Ramaphosa writes? Who is he writing this to? Because if you are talking to the citizens, you must find methods that 
the citizens like an ordinary person will have access to. For instance, if it was Ramaphosa's YouTube channel, it makes sense. People can go there, view the channel. But if it's a letter, how many people are, are readers in this country? So if Ramaphosa continues to write letters, it just shows that Ramaphosa is white inside and black outside. Who are you speaking to when you continue writing those letters? He's been doing it. I don't, I don't disagree. But who are you talking to? Unless you are telling me your aim is not to talk to the, ma to, to the majority of South Africans. Because you can't argue the point that you are talking to everybody here. When you want to make a speech, you go to a network, SAPC one, you are on live on national television. You, you, that's no longer fair then. Because clearly you show that uh, for you to reach other people, you need to go to national television. So once you put that distinction, it means your newsletters does not reach everybody. So who are you writing to? But let's continue to listen to him talking about the government of national corruption. He says, um, Our started commitment to work together constructively and for South Africans' benefit, uh, benefit has generated a great deal of goodwill that should not, look, should not squander. Ramaphosa said, Effort must be made to ensure that the government of national corruption remains true to its founding principle of collaboration to improve the lives of all South Africans. He says, South Africans must make clear, look, South Africans made clear their wish in last month's election that they want they want their elected representative to to put aside look, a narrow interest and work together to build the country. To do so, the government of national confusion cannot be preoccupied with joking for, for positions uh, tasteless over appointment or uh, squabbles within within and between parties. The success of the government of national unity will be um, look will be measured by the extent to which we are we are prepared to focus not on who will govern but how will we govern together. Um, I think that's unfair. It's a very unfair to say that because. The ANC is sitting at a very advantageous position in terms of that. So um, I can't even take the ANC for what they are saying because they are the ones who are leading this whole thing. Are they not? They are. So that same people can't come to us and say it's not about who is in power, but it's about how do we share this power together in advancing of this country, uh, country's interest. You can't say that when you are already sitting at a position of advantage. Uh, it just doesn't make sense. It really doesn't make sense. It's like fighting a, fighting an army, a person who has tra been trained in an army, who will say just because they are not wearing the 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 the, the, the uniform uh, from the SNTF, they will say just because they are not wearing the uniform, they will say, nah, but we are equal. No, you have got training that I don't have. So you're most likely to win the fight than me. It's a fact, right? It's a fact. You have been trained to endure. I am not trained to endure certain things. You know what I'm saying? So you have received some certain training that an ordinary person does not have. So you have, you've got an advantage with or without the uniform, with or without the gun. You just have advantage over an ordinary citizen. It ends there. That is the ANC trying to say, I, they, just danger, this thing of saying, ah, oh, it's not about positions. If it wasn't about positions, let's quite let's be quite honest. Why will the ANC rush to secure the position of uh, Speaker of Parliament, to secure the position of um, three key positions? I forgot the other one, the, the, the presidential position, the, the national speaker, and I forgot the other one. Why will they rush to occupy that? That's why I told you this is a, a government of national confusion instead of being a government of, of national unity, right? There's no unity that you can build there uh, when other people are already sitting at the point of advantage, telling others that, no, we are equal. No, no. It's like a monk saying to you, saying to a um, saying to a uh, fish, ah, we are equal. Now you just have to climb the tree, man. Come on. You can do it, man. We are equal. No, there's no such a thing. We are not equal. These two are not equal. 
a fish i mean a fish has got advantage over a monkey in the sea or in water vice versa the monkey has got an advantage uh, over the fish in the climbing trees it's just a fact a matter of life fact of life